<sighs> I've been waiting to zip those legs off for so long now. Oh, it feels good to be back in shorts. Alrighty, my friends. So today our activity is really an activity. It's not a craft. We are going to do balloon games. So you really only need two things for this. You need some balloons and a marker if you want to uh, write your name on it. So step number one, blow up your balloon. And then tie it off. And then if you want to, you can write your name on it. Or I'm just gonna draw a smiley face on mine. <laughs> now, my office is too small to play balloon games in, so I need to go find a bigger space. Let's go! All right, so one game you can play with a balloon is called balloon volleyball, which is basically just volleyball, but with a balloon. So you can play it by yourself, or you can play with a partner. If you're gonna play by yourself, you would bounce off the wall like this. And just try not to let it hit the floor. But if you were going to play volleyball with somebody else, you would obviously hit it back and forth, kind of like this. Oh my goodness. All right, another fun game that you can play with your balloons is just don't let the balloon touch the floor, which is like that, everybody's heard of that game, right? So you just try to keep your balloon up in the air for as long as possible. And you can't hold it, you can only hit it. See, I just lost. And then another fun thing that you guys could do would be you could do a relay race where you go back and forth and you um, have to carry the balloon between your knees. So that would look something like this. Whoever gets done first is the winner. Alrighty guys, I hope you had fun playing your balloon games. I know I sure had fun playing with my friend, Mr. Balloonhead. Um, but uh, until next week, uh, Scout Salute, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.